Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Uh, let's make that a bit neater. We don't need that for a minute. So we've returned the other vehicles, we've kept these for now. We've just taken on a fertilising contract. Which we're going to quickly knock on out because it's easy money. Not really one for a for a crop tie, but it does make sense. Uh, which field are we doing? And then I think we'll pick up the ploughing contract as well, just because. Um, and then we're definitely. I think we've got enough to buy a truck. I think in a tractor, maybe a car, but we need our own transport. Uh, there's been a development, uh, and then these two aren't that bigger taker, so that's going to be a quick eight grand for us, really. So we'll do them if that's still there when we come back. Uh, that is field two which we've been to I think yeah let's just get this loaded up So I've just been over to the bank during lunch. Uh, old Uncle Jim, not Jim, Mick. Jim, he's Uncle Jim. Didn't read the script properly. Um, <laughs> he, uh, he left a bit of debt. Two hundred thousand dollars worth of debt, to be precise, that I did not know about. Now, there's a good question to be asked of if you would have knew it was two hundred grand of debt and that patch of land and an old school bus, would you have come over? The answer would have been a resounding no chance but it is what it is now so I feel it important that we pay back the 200 grand And it sort of makes my mind up about whether we're going to be staying for a bit. So, so that's where we're at. Spoke to everybody back home. They're uh, they're in full support. So I'm thinking if we can get these two contracts done, we can buy the vehicle we need to go around and do some bits. I'm not sure entirely just as yet where this money is owed to. Apparently his name comes up with the iron ore again. The mine. There's an iron mine. 
So we may have to. Oh yeah, I nearly went wrong, didn't it? Should we be? Should we do the outline first? I'll end up getting wet. It's not our vehicle. How much is that patch of land there? Because that is as flat as a pancake. 41. 50,000? Hello. That's got potential written all over it. It's beautifully flat. What about is this a bit that we can can that be bought? No. Well it can, but everything has a price. Forty is interesting. It's only twenty thousand. I might be flat enough to put something nicer than a school bus on that. Sleeping in that school bus is horrendous. It's interesting though, if he's Managed to get into two hundred thousand pound of debt. I don't think that patch of land is worth anything substantial. Just a few old trees. It's not very level. And he's something to do with the mine. Suggests that he was. It suggests something went wrong at some point for him. Is a shame. So, two hundred grand. jump out while it's moving and the debt was tied to that patch of land not to any other patch of land so I suppose that means, as we've signed, transferred the the land into our name, we're going to have to pay interest on that. So the quicker we pay it off, the better. I think I can remember to... of the artefacts I saw the pictures for them looking for them and saying a reward would be given so we're probably going to have to look into that mm. 
it's good that these guys have asked us to do uh, this field again didn't ask us to plow it though or cultivate it which is a bit of a shame although we have been busy rolling trailers and Store. Lovely quick job that. Yeah, that is prime real estate for fifty thousand. Let's pop it round here. And then they can come and pick it up easy enough. Oh, that note. Bit of ploughing. Make sure you press borrow. Field three. Which one's field three? Is that the one we've just. That's not a field, that's just like a meadow. Field three. There. Just the three fields. Maybe we get a bit of land and bring some more crops to the area. Don't know if you could get much in there. Definitely put one there. Forty two is only thirty six grand. Let's uh let's have a little look at that as we drive up. That's where we've just done the rock picking, that was hundred and fifteen. Hmm. Intriguing. I think this will require the weight. I love a class.
pretty easy to drive everywhere around here. I'll stick it right out across the road, pretty much. That's better. Now this is nice and flat as well. That's 30 odd grand. 36. I mean we could technically buy that right now. Can't do anything with it because we've got no vehicle but... Bags of potential there. It's got to be something down around there, isn't there? Be bought. It's going to live on the <laughs> archipelago of the islands. It's actually got quite a decent bit of space there huh? and a price to match. Oh, yeah. I do apologise. Um, mm, mm, mm. This is quite a nice farm though, isn't it? Let's just set you back. 115. Right, this might take a while so I'll come back to you on this because we're already ticking away.
nearly there. Couple of passes, hopefully. It says it's finished, but we'll we'll make sure we do a complete job or as good as possible. There is two little spots, but to be fair, you can you can pull that out with your hand. They're going to come and inspect it. I'd have thought. I don't necessarily want to buy any of these fields because I like the fact that there is the potential of Go on, I'm feeling generous um, the potential of didn't need to do that no. yeah well of having contracts and but I'm quite happy to do some arable farming of our own if we end up with a bit of land. I'm gonna be here for a while if we're gonna pay that debt off. And it is nice out here. I'll just come back for that. Leave out the other way anyway. Now you might be thinking, what was this episode four, and we've pretty much been doing farming, but that's because it's September. There's not going to be a lot to do across these three fields. And while we've got the opportunity to make money on it and keep it varied as we can I think it's uh, interesting I think it's an important uh, job to do. The price of the some of the land has got me rather excited though I've got to be honest. So next we need to be down this way. I think that's a really good spot for us to look at teching.
Right now. Oh, I've got to open it before you put it down. I'm just going to leave it there. Then come and pick it up. They'll want it connected, I'm sure. Even though they probably don't want it connected because it might put too much strain on the tractor. Right. Let's get that collected. A bit more rock removal. I thought you'd never ask. For the meantime, oh, it's telling you what the lease price is. Ah, I've never actually looked at the screen really. 1800 quid dollars. The bag, big bag handle is an absolute bargain, isn't it? We've spent 93 dollars. water carrier and it's just sitting up at the not even a point one of an hour on it oh well to the shop what's no that's tempting but it is a little bit cheaty You need a big, a big old engine for it anyway. That would be nice. But our first vehicle to get us up and running is going to be refurbished. I'd really like it to be that, but I'm going to get a Fiat. First up, attaches hydraulic and a PTO, definitely. Ooh, definitely. Wheel set up. 132, it's only going to go at 15 mile an hour. It's not going to be the quickest, but the chunky tyres look pretty cool. Um, I like the Radesteins. So now it just depends. feel like it should be the biggest boys that we can get stock exhaust no no oh and said that that adds an extra well that puts up to 185 horsepower so that's a that's a yes please Colours. All orange. Mm. Mm. 
quite like it like that. A license plate. Might have to be that. First time I'm putting a number plate on, I suppose it's our first vehicle we're buying. Oh, that fits perfect. traditional blue thirty grand hundred and eighty five horses bought that's not the only thing we need to buy because if we're moving tree stumps or tree stumps trees I got rid of that trailer, didn't I? Uh, forestry equipment. not too bad for 18 grand is it but we do need a yarder or a winch so we're getting one of them and we We'll get a trailer. That one worked. For, that's five and a half grand. Give that a go. At least that's give that a go. Why not?
Yeah. Oh, that sounds nice. Top speed of 21 now as well. So that's... I mean, that is actually decent. And it's got a front PTO, so that can go on the front. This is fantastic. Nice and old. No messing about. Nowhere to put your coffee. No rear view mirror. No radio. We'll have to sing. I think there's mirrors, but I, oh no, I went the wrong way around, didn't I? Probably won't be able to line up with the mirrors. Definitely messed that up. Doesn't want to go into reverse. Uh -huh. What's going on? Interesting. It doesn't want to move. Okay, let me come back to you momentarily. Okay, we're back. I've restarted it and it seems to be working. Not quite sure what happened there, but... guys at the
shop managed to get it to up and running again not that There we go. There we go. What's activate lock? Ah, it's got a dolly. Not a fan of a dolly. That what activate lock does. Unsure. Anyway, let's get loaded up. So we've got some work to be done. Nice and wide, this, isn't it? Well, I'm probably going to go and do that rock smashing, seems as the opportunity is here. And I know I keep saying that I don't know what lock is. I'm going to do the rocks first, but I'll do that. Oh yeah, that's a strange position to be in. Well, we've took the job now. At least we can come back down and start logging down there for the next episode. So next episode we will definitely be moving logs but there's some progress we've got ourselves a vehicle it's an absolute beauty as long as it works. If you've enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed yet and you want to see the logging, the deadwood, then please hit the subscribe button and you will be updated when the new video comes live.
and until next time thank you so much for watching bye bye for now